The USF School of Geosciences is gaining international attention. One of their professors revealed the discovery of a rock that has never been seen before on Earth. And it was all thanks to something many Tampa Bay residents take for granted. ABC Action News reporter Robert Boyd stopped by the lab to find out more. Well, this week everyone's talking about lightning hockey, but we're actually talking about lightning in the sky, specifically a discovery made by USF geosciences professor Dr. Pasek when lightning hit a tree, creating this one of a kind discovery. When Dr. Matthew Pasek looks through his microscope, he sees more than just a rock, but a scientific breakthrough he had been hypothesizing for years. And you'll never guess where he found it. There was a thunderstorm in Port Ritchie, uh, Florida, and some people went out afterwards, saw that a tree and a tree root had been struck by it, dug it up, and decided, hey, we'll sell it on eBay. Dr. Pasek purchased the rock and soon discovered that it contained a phosphorus material never seen before. So in this case, this is the first time we have found this specific material in a actual rock sample on the surface of the earth. First time. Uh, first time. Right, right here in Florida. <laughs> first time right here in Florida. Dr. Pasek believes this isn't the first time this type of rock was formed on Earth. Just the first time scientists noticed it. There are trees across Tampa Bay, just like this one on campus, that are struck by lightning. Lightning traveled down, probably went into the roots, and some of those roots had uh, bits of iron around them, and then the root and the iron and the sand all kind of melted together. His findings were recently published in the online journal Communications, Earth and Environment. It's something you put a lot of hard work into. You have a, a, a nice eureka moment here and there in it, and it's good to see that everything is coming together and others can take a look at it as well. Dr. Pasek is now in the process of presenting his discovery to the International Mineralogical Association in hopes that it's classified as a new mineral. So you bought it for 150 <laughs> bucks. Do you think you got a deal? I did get a deal. <laughs> in Tampa, Robert Boyd, ABC Action News.